<clears throat> hey guys, this video is a response to my aunt, Andrea Torres Locker. She she shared a video of me on Facebook because she knows I she knows I'm a enthusiast for um, gel pens, and uh, she sent me a vi shared a video with me of someone doodling with the with these uh, like glitterish, metallicish gel pens. And I kind of knew what they were. Or she told me, but um. But I never really thought about it, and uh, when she shared that video with me, and she said I should add this to my collection, and I'm like, you know what, you're right. I think I will. So uh, today, I got some pins, and I told her I'll make this video for her. So here's one of them. This one is like a like a light bluish. Oops. It's sorry, I, um, it's hard for me to write because I'm looking through the crema and I'm not using one hand to hold the paper down. See, it's, so it's just like blue. And you can like sort of see like a glitter in there. And there's the other one. The silver one is freaking awesome. You see what I mean. So I can't really write my name right because I'm the papers keep moving and I'm holding the crama. See? It's just so it's just gray. It's just gray. But what's the cool about these? These could actually write on black paper. No freaking kidding, seriously. So I'm gonna grab that next. Okay, here we go. Now here comes the awesome part. So, Andrea Locker, I want to say thank you for sharing that video with me. And this video is, re this video is for you. Look at that sweetness. Just look at that. See that? That is so cool. And here comes the, the, the silver one. Now check this out. This thing is like a freaking mirror. Watch. Let's check it out. Ready? This thing is like a freaking mirror. Look at that. It's just like a mirror. It is piercing chrome. It's like a mirror. It's it's like it looks like white from the crama because it doesn't do its justice. But it seriously looks like a mirror. If you don't believe me, go to Winkle. It's only like six bucks. Get it? It's made by Pintel. It's a Pintel. It's called a. Pintail, as you see right there, sparkle pop. It's freaking awesome. It's well, well worth the six bucks. I'm not really doodling or it's more like a swatch because I had to really be focused with my bare out naked eyes. And look into the screen. So uh, it's more like a swatch. What I'm doing right now. So in this case, you're wondering, like, oh, he ain't drawing anything. Why is he just scribbling? Well, because I am scribbling. It's just. Yeah, it's just. I don't know. It's like. It's like someone melted the T1000 Terminator. I put it inside the ink cartridge and make a pen out of it. That's where it just looks like the freaking T1000 liquid metal. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's like a mirror. 
I know I keep repeating over and over again like a broken record, but you know, it is what it is. So once again, thank you, Andrea, my most favorite aunt of all time. This video is for you. Thank you so much, Andy. Thank you. Thank you for showing me in that video clip. I appreciate it. And I went and bought it. It's just so cool. Thank you. And here's the now that's doodling right there. See that? It looks like a mirror. Here's this one. And here's my name. See how the bottom one it looks like a mirror? Trust me, it's a lot brighter in person. Yeah, so before I filmed, I was gonna doodle this right here. I wasn't doing on crama, but I can't, you know, I, cause I can't hold my phone sideways for too long to, to get a full screen. Normally I have to film it upwards, which I don't like because it looks like a, it just, I just don't like that. The video is annoying because it's, it's just in the middle and the side is just black. So, so I wasn't going to do this, but you know, I don't want to hold it sideways and I want a full screen. So that's why I went ahead and doodled this before on Krama. Oh man, that's just gorgeous. How can you hate this? Seriously. I don't care how old you are. You could be, uh, you know, you could be an 800,000 year old vampire. I don't care how old you are. You know, don't take it all oh, for kids. It's, it's for little girls. No, it's for anybody. It's just, look at that, it's awesome. Of course, my doodling is nowhere as good as uh, Peter Draws, but hey, at least I'm trying. I'm getting better though. No doubt about it, I am getting a lot better with my doodling. It, doodle, doodle, doodling is, is really not that hard. It's pretty easy. But Peter Draw, his doodling is a little bit different. His doodling is more like um, doodling slash sketch art. It, if you don't, well, just go, you know, just go on YouTube, look up Peter Draws. You know, I'll, I'll write it down. I don't want to ruin my draw, my doodling. If you want to check him out? I wanted to put the crime on pause so I could write his name. So, okay, I'm back. <clears throat> I know I'm going off topic now, but for your other viewers out there, Peter Draws. I don't even know if I spelled his name right. I think I spelled it wrong. I think I did spell his name wrong. Hang on. Let's scratch that out. We'll quit. I have no... I don't know why I even put two T's. I'm not... You know, I'm not good at spelling. I never was. I was never a good speller. I always have to, I always have to use checkpoints on the phone. I know. It's pretty sad for a 33-year-old man. The cat spell right. Well, whatever. I don't know. Go ahead. I don't, I don't know. Just, just look up Peter Draws. You see what I'm talking about. So once again, thank you, Aunt Andrea, for showing me the video. And. If you want to learn how to doodle, just keep practicing. Just, uh, you know, even though if you don't think it's perfect, just tell yourself this. It looks good, no matter what. Just keep telling yourself that. That's what Bob Ross son once said on one of his videos. Because uh, Bob Ross son, Steve Ross, was a special guest on one of his shows 
and he he said that. So yeah, let's look up Peter Draw. His doodling is like you know, doodling art sketch. I don't know. He's he's a genius. He's like a. I don't know. He's he's just he's very very talented. And thank you.